So next I want to show you meet in the middle attacks. Um, this is a type of attack that shows how unintuitive security can be in terms of cryptography. Um, as you remember, hopefully, we had this DES, the data encryption standard, and it has just, the key is just plain too small. So we just use DES three times as a temporary fix. So you might wonder why don't we just use DES two times and just encrypt two times and then have a security level of 112, which is already really close to AES, which should be fine. Well, that's because then we could mount a meet in the middle attack. So imagine you do a double DES, you just say, okay, I take two random keys, then I encrypt the plain text with the key, and then the ciphertext I encrypt with a different key. Therefore, I have used DES twice, so I should have a security level of 2 to the 56th and times 2 to the 56th, right? Because I've used true independent keys. So I should end up with a security level of something like this, 112 bits, right? Well, not exactly. Now imagine we create a table where we have a one plain text and ciphertext pair. So an oracle granted the success to one plain text and one ciphertext under an unknown key. And we want to decrypt other ciphertexts that we don't know the plain text to. So what we could do to recover the keys is we could create a table with all possible decryptions of key 2 of the ciphertext under key 2, yeah. All possible decryptions of the ciphertext and key 2. Afterwards, when we have this table of all possible descriptions, decryptions of key, two, key 1, we go through all possible key 2 values, encrypt our known plain text, and then compare the encryption of our known plain text with key 2 with decryptions of ciphertext with key 1. And we go through this table of all possible key 1 decryptions until we find a row where the decryption of the ciphertext under key 1 is identical with the encryption of the plain text with key 2. And if we have found this match, then we have found the actual key 1 and key 2. Because these are the only possibilities for having this plain text encrypted twice into a ciphertext. And therefore we have found both keys and can decrypt other messages or re-encrypt different messages. So what is the security level? Well, actually, if you think about it, we had to encrypt, uh, decrypt all with all possible key one values. That was 256 values stored that in a table. And then we had to, on worst case, go through all possible keys of key two, which is again 256 possibilities. So we only had to go through 2 to the power of 56 keys two times. So we actually just had a security level of 2 to the power of 57, which is just one bit more than with single DES. So by applying the encryption twice, we have actually only one one bit of additional security. This attack applies in many cases. Um, I'll show you examples in the upcoming weeks. Um, but it also gives an intuition about that cryptography and levels of security
can be quite unintuitive. Once you've found an attack for something, maybe the security is not what you thought it was.